What's happening, YouTube? <sighs> Keeping on the same wavelength or whatever you want to call it as this little kick I've been on lately about getting ready for some hard times, maybe. Look, what I did here was $85,000 down payment. Payments are 1700 bucks a month. So if you're 30 nothing and you're somewhere in the country and you got a little something sitting somewhere and you're in the big city and you're like, there's no way. Well, I'm here to tell you, yeah, there is. Yeah, I got my social security and shit stitched up. So my income is not an issue, but this property... <laughs> That's the little itsy bitsy front yard, but this property used to be a Christmas tree farm. Here. Out this window, oh, the glare's gonna fuck it, but that auto shop supported a truck and equipment, and uh, you ain't gonna be able to see, maybe out this other window. Yeah, <laughs> but off in the distance back there, that baby blue and tan building behind the guest house, that steel building back there with the dirt floor, that's where they probably kept the Christmas trees that they harvested off of that big empty lot right there, right? And they kept critters in the barn and in that field over there. So they had <clears throat> a working farm here. So if you were to take your little nest egg, <clears throat> excuse me, of, you know, 100 grand or less, do some homework, look around, be willing to live in some harsh conditions, you can go get land and infrastructure right i'm nothing special i'm no einstein uh real estate agent i just wouldn't take no for an answer i saw something and somebody said a prayer and before you knew it johnny's in god's country right it, it's like that really it is and um it can be done you know interest rates are going up quickly but the cost of real estate is going to start going in the toilet, right? Real estate's going to start getting cheaper. So if you're sitting on cash, it'd be a good time to make a move, a permanent move, right? Food for thought, right? <laughs> And it's just so hard for me to to give you proper wait till we get on a piece of equipment out on on the property. Just how vast shit is out there. And the barn and that field over there. It's crazy. It is. It really trips me out because it's just <clears throat> so much. All right, this is some more of that, like, the silver dime thing, you know? Got no shoes on. It's cold as fuck. See what I'm saying? It's like, I don't even want to raise my voice out here. It's so quiet. <laughs> and it's cold as a motherfucker. Yeah, can you see the temp? <laughs> it's 10 degrees out. <laughs> no fucking. <laughs> 
That is hilarious. It's 10 degrees out. I don't even have sleeves on. <clears throat> no fucks given. So, let me move some things around right quick. So, to get back on point, it don't take a shit ton of money to do what I did and to go get you some. But the thing is, tick tock, tick tock, these properties are going to get harder and harder to get. More and more people are going to think about doing what I'm doing, right? I did this for dogs, but now that these idiots on the tube are talking food shortages, how many people do you think want to have what I have right now? Think about it. Just don't take too long pulling the trigger and making a decision because it's just going to get harder to find. And these properties probably will go up in price, I'm guessing, because the ability to grow food and house livestock. You know, there's more of these properties around all over the country in depressed areas of the country. Tennessee, Kentucky, there's stuff all over, man. I like it up here in the Northwoods. I like this cold, right? I was just outside 10 degrees out. I'm not tripping. I like it. I do. You know, it's not for everyone. And that's why it's affordable. Right? So think long and hard about what you want for your life in the next 10 or 20 years. It's not going to be the same as it was for the last 50. Shit's going to change quickly, dramatically, and good people are going to get hurt because they're not going to listen. What are you going to do? <clears throat> and if I'm wrong, well, worst case scenario, I'm doing my doggy thing, right? I don't have to help you fools. My gut tells me I'm going to have more humans on Misfit Island than I anticipated because of this nonsense on the tube. It's crazy. WW3, please. But boy, they're sure hyping it. Anyway, y'all have a beautiful day. Much love and respect to each and every one of you. Please do me a favor. Like, subscribe, and share. Right? These videos are getting hammered again. <laughs> I might have some news on some of that front. There might be somebody in some hot water. But anyway... I ain't going to speak on it until I know for sure. And when I know for sure, there might even be a mug shot. <laughs> anyway, we'll talk soon. Peace.